my favorite thing about working on the robotics project was thinking about what we did and it gives you a little bit more insight on how you did it. Uh, the teamwork and building with everybody to help out. Oh, so I, I really liked how we got to make it move and how um, we got to like control it. Being able to work with like electronics and stuff. I liked like finding the right pieces and like putting them on like where it's supposed to go. Getting to actually like build the hand. Probably just getting to set it up and finding out how it works and stuff. Building the hand and trying to like connect it and make it into like programming it. Probably uh, building the hands and like helping Battle Raid and everybody. Some of the challenges were um, trying to listen to each other and not like getting in a fight about what we're supposed to do and them actually doing the work, not one of us. We had this one finger that just wouldn't, like, when we pressed the button, it just wouldn't go down, so it was just like this. It's getting the screws in the right place and making sure everything was correctly done. When Mr. McGrath messed up the finger and we had to um, rebuild it because um, it was, it, you didn't see the string go through the hand. Uh, try to put the hands in while you uh, try to bolt it in. Uh, putting the wires in, it like never worked, so trying to tie the knots tight enough. Uh, probably getting it like the um, strings all in the little whole things. I'm trying to get the motors to work. I was very excited because, um, well, I like to build electronic things and yeah. I was really happy because I'm a coder and I like building things. I've always been interested in robotics and stuff, but I've never done anything like it, so I thought this could be my chance to try it out. So like, that, was, that sounds interesting. I, I think I'll do it. I thought it was gonna be like a fun project and then it was. My initial reaction was like, yay, I get to work on this and then, yeah. I would recommend it because um, it will be a fun source of, like if you have no homework, you can do that in your free time, and it's just really fun. I would definitely recommend it to my friends in the future. Because they can, they can, they can learn how to build stuff, but, and then they can try to program stuff to learn programming. Yeah, I did like working with uh, teams because it uh, gave everyone a chance who wanted to do it. Um, we got to know a few things about each other when we were working as a team. So it was like, say one person was like reading the instructions while the other person was following them. I really liked it because we could all get different time chances to do different things and you work with others so you learn cooperation. There was like some difficulty in the first like week or two, and then we started like focusing a lot more at the second, third week. In the fall, uh, Mr. McGrath and I um, got an email, and it was, "Are you interested in this grant opportunity?" And I teach Project Lead the Way, and I teach like engineering, and so I saw it had some opportunities with that. So uh, Nikki Jones joined us as well, and we applied, and we were we received the robotics grant. I definitely enjoy how excited they get when they accomplish something. I just started working with the seventh graders on actually like programming and, and just how engaged every single one of my students is, is insane. Like all year, or, you know, all year it's like trying to get them all to be engaged and now they're just like, what's going on with the hand? And if anything, they get mad if another kid is taking over the project. And I'm like, kids that normally, you know, check out or don't pay attention are like interested in the project. That's been my favorite. So um, I think what I've learned from this project is to jump on an opportunity when it comes. So sometimes you get the emails or the requests for things and you kind of maybe ignore it, but it, this situation I'm really glad that we 
saw the email, responded to the email, took the opportunity, and just seeing how it has impacted the kids and given them the opportunity to do something that they've never done before. And I'm really excited that I'll have the opportunity to do it again next year and continue to introduce it to kids over the next few years.